All right, I see something in that trash. Curbside, baby. Oh, we curbsiding it. it curb, blah, 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 blah. Curbsiding it up this morning. <sighs> I hope it's not going to be a day like this, though. Where we're literally, like, picking up crumbs all along the way. But, hey. Uh, crumbs are my middle name. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. Let's go get it. Got a little something over here. Look like a little bicycle. And when I say little bicycle, I mean like little bicycle. <laughs> hey, scrap, 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 scrap. All right, let's see. There, our pile stuff got us a little hole here. Let's hope we can fill up this hole and get to the scrapyard. Hole. All right, I saw the light or something back here. A light on. It was gross out here. Yeah, there we go. <clears throat> and what's crazy, I already seen like a dude literally driving around, pulling a trailer. Had a bunch of scrap. <clears throat> it's tough out here. It's tough on these streets, man. I see something up here. Hopefully we don't get screamed at by somebody. But it's definitely trash. It's just not by the street. Look at that, look at that. I got big milk jugs. Chill. Sure. Big jugs, big jugs. Oh, oh, it's a little light. I don't know. Oh no, no, no. Alright. Don't take that. Alright. Sweet. Mm. Alright. Got some stuff over here, man. Let's get to the pot nipples. Uh, pull forward just a little bit. There's all kinds of stuff up in here. lights up in there Christmas stuff in here lots of totes my goats more Christmas stuff let's see what we got in here Lots of totes though. Ooh, look at that. Good stuff right there. Right. I bet that ain't gonna... More decorations. <sighs> Roller blades. <sighs> I don't want to start opening their stuff. That would be just straight rude. Look at all that. <sighs> I might clean out a closet. <sighs> Hey, we got stuff that goes through. Yeah, we do. It looks like some books and stuff. All right. We'll pick it up a little bit. Hmm. Works for me. There goes a big old pile of stuff right here. 
Man, more stuff. It's like garage sale stuff. Let's grab it. Pilfer through it. I like pilfering through people's stuff. Well, shoot, we're almost full. <laughs> We get loaded up on the garage sale stuff. Mm -hmm. oh. we'll grab this guy right here. Uh. 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 There's some stuff. More stuff. It's in these toads here. It's like sheets. I don't care for sheets. I got some more stuff here. Well, I wanted to fill her with scrap, but I guess we'll take this instead. This stuff's just as good. You just don't make his money as fast. All right, we'll grab this one. All right, baby. Okay. This looks like Christmas lights or something. Grab them. Like a picture frame. Although it's broken. <sighs> All right, grab some stuff. Okay. Woo! We passed up a lot. Uh, 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 what up, Scrap? What up, cuz? Uh, they even got the mounting stuff. Not that I needed or nothing, but you know. Oh, yeah. Ooh. All right, check it out, y'all. Scrap, man. Scrap left for the scrap man. <laughs> up there scrap that is what that is man <clears throat> yeah let's see here get a little tight on space but we got room for the scrap up here in the front we'll get our goodies back here try not to break try not to break it all you know what I mean yeah we'll leave that Leave that. Uh, no mess. What up? All right. Having to work for it today. <laughs> oh, what up, little fan? How we doing? You want to jump in the truck with Mike? <laughs> Come on in. Water's fine. I feel like I seen something back here. I might just be tripping though. That look like a power cord. Or is that not? That's not. Damn it. Well, alrighty, scavengers. Uh, kind of weird, I guess, successful day. Curbside scavenging out there. Um, I really was hoping to fill her up with some scrap, but at the end of the day, it looks like we got totes and totes and totes full of absolute just stuff. So, uh, yeah, I mean, I guess we didn't get the scrap department, we definitely got the garage sale, slash garage sale department. But uh, anyways, yeah, so let's go ahead and just start tearing into our stuff and see what we got here. Uh, got these big milk jugs. I looked on the bottom, they say 70 bucks Hobby Lobby. So, you know, they pay $35 a piece for it, but still, easily probably get five, 10 bucks a pop. On these, 
we had to kind of go up in the driveway and get them a little bit it's kind of weird people in that neighborhood sometimes they have their trash halfway up the driveway i guess that's to keep people like me from like doing what we do but we still do it so there you go ah uh, all right those glasses start Whew. just start tearing at it looks like uh Rod cell stuff. That's definitely part of a lamp. Lots of tchotchke. 25 cent, 50 cent pieces. Man USA model 330. Lamp light. Something. Something lamp light. Oh, Got something wrapped up in here. Oh my gosh, you know what this is? Oh, I don't think this is the same thing. I remember all them bears I found a while back? A whole collection of bears? That almost looks like the same type of bears. I forget the name of them. Alright, see here. Tchotchke stuff, tchotchke stuff. I guess that goes in your kitchen. Maybe, on your kitchen. Plants. Golly, look at all this stuff. That's a candle holder right there. A little decorative plant. Garden ridge. You know that's old. Uh, decorative little plants here. Ooh, got some old tins. These are even priced for to sell. 25 cents a piece. So they probably picked these up at a garage sale. So. Got a can of old tin can green beans that would probably sell Tootsie Roll 1896-1996 that's the uh, what's that the Centennial I like Tootsie Rolls I could do some Tootsie Roll Let's see here got some seeds ooh what is that something in there is that a hairnet for little people Maybe. Uh, this is a uh, so for coffee or tea. Yeah, probably something to help keep it warm. Grasdale tchotchke stuff. It's a little plate. I don't know, I saw green paint on it. Made me think of that. This old Tupperware. Yeah, that's Tupperware right there. Little cheese grater, plastic cheese grater. More plants, uh, decorative stuff. Got a pot. A little. Right. All right. Now this looks interesting. Is that a spittoon? It's definitely brass. Looks cute. Pretty. All right. Let's see. Look at that. It's even got the lid. It has something glued on it, looks like. Decorative stuff. This is probably somebody's old kitchen. Kitchen decor. The pop and cob. Microwave popcorn on the cob. That's interesting. Huh. Pops off the cob in your microwave. Ugh. What we got here, y'all? Is that a... Oh, I saw the core. I was thinking it's a heat blanket. It looks like just a, uh, a table runner right here. Uh, what we got here? Oh, there's a uh, coffee grinder. There's the lid. I'm grinding your stuff. Alright. Peace be to this house. Kitchen stuff. There's a little mirror. Mirror table thingamajigger there. Picture frame here. Old magazine, Martha Stewart Living, June of 09. All right, all right, all right. Well, let me get this cleaned up and we'll get on to the next bucket. All right, moving along. Next tote, next tote. Mom's apple pie. Slices 10 cents. Fetch a couple of, couple of pennies there, a little basket. Looks like we got a fry basket here. We got some pins. I don't know what that is. Uh, little table. 
look like there's probably a piece of glass goes over it, a little cake table. Good for decorative stuff, staging stuff. All right, chicken stuff for people who like chickens. Little hanger there. Uh, Martha Stewart. Oh, okay, Martha Stewart doesn't live here. So don't complain about the cooking. Because she don't. Ooh, I think this... Does it go with that? I don't think so. I think that's two totally different things. But that's a little table of some sort. Let's see if we got some clothes. There's a skunk. Ooh, man, 1990 called. Who wants their jeans back? Right. Clothes there. Rug there. Not a whole lot happening up in here. Some plastic mugs, table stuff. There's a purse. I always check purses. Look at that. There's stuff in there. Let's see. Kathy Vaughn Zeeland. Is that for your cell phone? Definitely old because the uh, iPhone ain't fitting in there. Yeah. Looks like she never even used it, but it's all just falling apart there. Sit down with the clothes, linens. There's a plate. Interesting looking plate. A rug. Take it over here, over here. It's like table, tablecloth cover stuff. Sit that over here. All right. Okay, all right, well, let me get this cleaned up, and we'll get on to the next box. All right, next box, coming up. Okay, got us a metal chicken. This, I didn't know what it was. That was a corner shelf. Looks like something has been chewing on it. A little sprinkler. This is a cool-looking lamp right here. These are those lights I grabbed. I will, I'll bet you they work. Not Christmas lights, just decorative lights. Box is all falling apart. This lamp's cool though. Ain't nothing more American than apples, huh? <laughs> Interesting looking lamp. It's for sure. Oh, there's a lampshade in here. What the heck? Oh, that's like a, uh, a quiet feed. Oh, there's some more of them lights. So we got more lights. Good stuff there. Quiet feed. Ooh, there's a nice sprinkler right there. Yeah, baby, that's a rainbird. That's some good stuff right there. More sprinkler stuff, sprinkler stuff. Look at that. Scrap. Sprinklers. That's probably just trash. Old radio. Flashlight. Duma flutcher. Guns. Some, some lid to the lid. Let's say the pot, spray guns here, timer here. It's ticking. Yeah, it looks like it just needs a new seal. Rock and roll, baby, rock and roll. Okay, let's move on to the next. All right, we go bang out two on this one. Let's see. All right, so we got us a little wooden magazine holder here. Some jeans, anything good? Nope. I don't really feel anything in the pockets. Is this a candle holder for your wall? Oh, it looked like it had a mirror in the back. That's cool. Put something else back there. Repurpose that. French vanilla, hard as a rock. A little vase, metal vase for your plants. Some more linen to touch. Oh, that's cute. $1.69 or two for three. 25 cent garage sale. Got a little clock here. Although the battery looks like it's. Get that out of there. Doesn't look too bad. Probably still work. kitchen stuff lots of seeds I'm wondering if that's bird seed and that's what we saw on that shelf it's all chewed up there was a freaking bird so yeah I can toss all this crap out 
and then keep this right here, the little the little rack. It's still got the tag on it. That's pretty sweet. Okay, we got a candle there. Right, set this over here, over here, over here, over here. Got us a funky looking lamp. That is. That looks like it may actually be the. Uh, I've never seen a lamp quite like this. But I'm thinking that's what it is. That's the top piece for it. Definitely old. You can tell age on these two by the plug. Like that plug has not been in uh, been installed on appliances in a long, long time. So this is probably 70s, maybe 60s. <sighs> There's a lamp. It's got stuff in it. Wonder if you could take the stuff out and put some new stuff in it. Same thing over here. A little lamp with stuff in it. Probably take it apart and put some. I guess that's potpourri they've got in there. I don't know. And stuff here. It's pretty. Thought it was one of them smoking devices there for a second. Mason jar. Those are always good. High Cotton Inn, Belleville, Texas. Walking on high cotton. Ooh, look at those, man. Boots, those are heavy duty. Steel toe, I think I like some wool in there. That's some neoprene. Those are a bit good for dumpster. They're kind of heavy though, a little bit heavy. Pictures, pictures, books. Oh, okay, the good stuff. Kitchens, decks, porches, patios. When to build and use greenhouses. Complete guide to decks. New living spaces, basic wiring, I could probably use to look at that. Finishing, ooh, techniques on finishing. And then what we got here? Oh, what we got here? A bunch of chess pieces I think goes with that over there because I see chess pieces. We'll see if we got them all. We'll go, you know, the Queen's Gambit on this thing. What is this? Old fashioned bar shampoo. Well, it's not that old fashioned. So I guess there's shampoo in there. The box is falling apart. There we go. Well, it's not that old. It's got a barcode sticker on it. So, all right, let me get this cleaned up and then we'll start working on those last boxes back there. All right, we'll throw these totes out. These are good totes. I'm glad I grabbed, stopped and grabbed all of this because I mean, we got totes, man. Totes. <sighs> Yeah, here's that chest stuff. I'll go through it and see if we got everything. Hopefully we do. This all I think was just decorative stuff. Oh, we do got our rollerblades though. Yeah, we have a sucker for rollerblading. I wonder what size those are. I'll totally rock them. If they're my size. Size eight to nine. A little bit small. Let's see. Scrap. Looks like we can grab this back here. Oops. It's a seven inch tiki. Alright, we got that pie bait. Yeah, not too hot in the scrap department. But alright, here we go. Let's dig in. So yeah, over here, little sports box. There's our little tiki guy. We'll set him. Right here. Roller blades, baby. Roller blades. I don't know what that is. Not a roller blade wheel. Baseballs. Sports stuff, you know. Good garage sale stuff. Over here. This looks like Halloween stuff. There goes a mask. Dude. Ooh, there's a hand in here. Looks like a scarecrow. Some gargoyles. Yep. Say, so, uh, some legs and a body.
Got me a, a person. <laughs> All right, so Halloween box. I might toss out the old Halloween box. Probably use that flannel shirt. Nice little flannel shirt there. All right, and then this goes with all of our, uh, I put the uh, chest pieces right here. We'll match them all up, see if it goes. There's no chest board that I have found yet. Trick or treat. Down here. All right, Christmas tote. Right. See, these are all empty here. here. I'm, I'm keeping these totes. These ones with the lids. A lid built in. I mean, shoot. And you got multiples. Ain't, ain't get much better than that. Yeah, Christmas decor. Christmas lights. Big balls. Looks like exterior stuff. Another empty tote. Got some totes for the scrap guy. You know, at the scrap yard. Got more lights, more decor. Now it's after after Christmas, so this stuff's gonna have to sit for a little bit. All right, we got a storage unit, we got the space. All right, and this is one of those fancy lights you shine at your house when you wanna be really lazy. Some ornaments. Hey, that's my, I try to do this every year. I try to talk to the wife into it so I don't have to climb up on the house, but she says, you're not gonna be lazy. You're not gonna be lazy. Pure glycerin soap. Hobby Lobby. I guess someone was looking into making their own soap. A vamp kit. For when we want to go all Twilight, you know. Team Edward. Plastic chain. Barbed wire. Not real barbed wire. Decor and such. Oh my gosh. We've got stuff. We've got stuff, stuff, stuff. That's over there. What is that? Is it just trash? Yeah, that's just just a piece of trash. Just a piece of trash. Little sticks. Fall and Halloween decor for the yard. And then our last tote. Ah! Boy, we didn't. Golly, I was kind of ticked off we didn't really do well in the scrap department but you know it's what it is we got a bunch of this stuff stuff to go through you never know you can find that that gym got some big pipe here thank you for whoever left that got us an arrow and a little spade and a Paint can opener. What we got here? Puzzles. Those were been pretty hot. Microsoft. Ooh. Well, we got Microsoft here. Microsoft made their own cars. I didn't know that. I didn't know that at all. I never knew Microsoft made their own little cars. A remote control car. Ooh, check it out, boomerangs, man. These are the gifts that you do not want your kids having. And this is from Hawaii. The boomerangs were more of like an Australian, a down under type of thing. Oh, this is like, is this something you light on fire? Like you see in Hawaii where they're like, whoa. Maybe. I have to brush up there. What the heck is this? I thought it was a guitar hero. But apparently it looks like it just makes noise. Wowee. It's a wowee. Ooh, is that a ukulele? Look at that. It's a little tiny one, probably all $5, but at the end of the day, got us a ukulele. <sighs> Mardi Gras coming up. Think I'll be ready to go with that. So we got some books here. Feats and failures, boy. Family math. Math. Got here. Spot it. Looks like a little game. 
some sort. And that looks to be it. Yep, that's that, that's that, that's that. Well, I mean, holy cow. I got some stuff I gotta price up, box up, get ready for a garage sale, but hey, I mean, I kind of kind of successful. So like I said, didn't get as much scrap as I wanted to get, but it is what it is. Ooh, the wife's gonna trip when she gets home. Oh, she's gonna trip. But anyways, well, alrighty, cats. That's gonna do it for this episode of Curbside Scavenging. I'm your host of the absolute most, Mike Scavenger. As always, it was a total pleasure. Be sure to like the video, subscribe to my channel. Shout out to everybody that bought some merch. Appreciate that. Down below, Teespring gives y'all some stuff if you're interested, guys. Uh, Instagram, got one, check it out. But uh, all right, like I said, I got my work cut out for me. I got some stuff I got to do here, clean this stuff up. And then we're going to plan on, uh, we're going to hit it. Do some more dumpster diving action, get it to you. So y'all stay tuned. Yeah.